to our channel. We are Michelle and Peachy. For those who are new to our channel, we are just two ordinary office workers in the IT world who loves to travel. So a year ago during the pandemic, we decided to get our RV, and now we've traveled over ten thousand miles with our moving home. Since fall is around the corner, we're going to talk about chasing fall foliage. For those of you who are planning on going this year, this would be a great guide before you go. So my first biggest question is, when to go and where to go? Blue Ridge and Smoky Mountain really come to life with new colors in the fall seasons. So fall colors change based on the elevations of the mountains.、Um, it goes from beginning of October all the way to mid November. So I break it down to three different sections based on the best time frame and the corresponding beautiful sceneries. If you are going from beginning of October to mid October, a good point to start is. Asheville, and drive along the Blue Ridge Parkway to Virginia Direction, up until to Grandfather Mountain, or even to Blowing Rock. If you are going between mid October till end of October,、uh, Asheville is still a good place to start. We actually went、uh, around mid late October last year. With our RV, and we stayed in Asheville, and it's gorgeous. So from mid October to late October,、um, starting from Asheville to Mount Mitchell, will be a pretty good route. And if you want to go through Smoky Mountain, you can also go from Cherokee and pass through the beautiful sceneries and stop around Gatlinburg area. If you're traveling from end October to early November, I would recommend Bryson City, North Carolina. It's a town surrounded by gorgeous fall colors.、Um, there is cute coffee shops.、Uh, you can grab a coffee and hop on the Smoky Mountain Railroad that departs from、um, Bryson City. There is also a Mikalola Fall, that's a really famous stop in the fall. And is an hour north of Atlanta, so that should give you a pretty good idea on where and when to visit the Great Smoky Mountains and Blue Ridge Parkway. That sounds awesome. Well, let me just pack up and go. Hold on, hold on. No, no, no.、Uh, actually, Smokies and Blue Ridge are extremely popular during the fall seasons, so you gotta really plan ahead because. Cabins,、um, hotels, even campgrounds get fully booked pretty early on. So there is always a risk for booking early、um, because fall color changes varies depending on the current year's weather.、Um, you just gotta play by ear and adjust your route if needed. All right, so that sounds like a day trip. Well. A day trip is kind of short. I would do a weekend, or even better, a three-day trip.、Um, there will be a lot of driving and lots of stop and go,、um, lookouts, beautiful sceneries,、um, and also definitely pack for lunch because you don't want to be starving. All right, I'm so ready to go. So, any last words before I head over? Well, be prepared to drive on windy roads and lots of up and downs.、Um, roads can get pretty congested on the weekends, so bring your patience with you. And also download some offline maps ahead of time because the phone service kind of sucks. All right, so that is it. Now let me show you some gorgeous footages of Blue Ridge Parkway from last year.
short video. Um, just a reminder, this is only a guide to help you plan.、Um, the time varies by a week or two, depending on the weather for the current year. So make sure you do your research ahead of time. Well, this is definitely a bucket list item. Hope this helps you with your planning and happy traveling.